Today we're going to be talking to you about our 10th anniversary edition Jackson Forward Fold. Let me show you some of the features. Now let's have a, have a look at your fridge slide box. Compression locks at the front there, gas strut assisted door, nice and easy. Pinch weld rubber seal right the way around the door, keep all the dust and water out as well. Nice big fridge slide in there as well. Take up to a good size 60 litre fridge in there. Easy done, unlock them, out they come. As you can see, it's all carpet lined as well for safety. Looks after your fridge. Tie down points everywhere there as well. They are supplied with tie down straps, so while you're travelling along, your fridge can sit in there. It's a 12 volt socket in the back there as well to plug into. It's also ventilated at the back of the box to keep everything nice and cool. So, travel and safety folks, keep your fridge in there, slide them away, absolutely beautiful. Up here as well, what we have is your pantry shelf. So, again, pinch weld rubber seals around your door there, keep all your dust and water out. You've got a great big shelf up the top there. You've also got a nice big pantry drawer there as well. Put all your foods, bits and pieces in. Plenty of room there for the family. Now let's have a look at the kitchen. So as you're pulling your stove out folks, spring it out nice and easy. Nice big heavy slides on there. Don't forget your support leg as well. So your support leg lives in underneath here. You'll find your little hole just there. So pop it in, lift it up. That'll support your kitchen nice and easily. Really nice little slide out bench there as well. You have plenty of storage space on there. One of the things you'll find in the Market Direct campers is the Italian Smev stove. These are a true off-road stove. Don't want a household stove in a camper trailer, you want an off-road one. Don't rattle around, nice and solid, the best sort of thing money can buy. Plenty of storage right the way through here as well. You've got a cutlery tray there as well to hold all your bits and pieces in so they're not rattling around everywhere. You've got another drawer in there, nice big drawer storage. Another door down there as well. It's, it's a full working proper kitchen so when you're out camping you can cook up a storm for the whole family. All of your water, all of your gas are all quick connect fittings as well so there's no having to move gas bottles around. Everything there is easy. You can literally have this kitchen up and going in a matter of moments. Here are at the back of the Jackson Ford file where you'll find dual spare wheels. Now you've got mud terrain tyres on alloy rims, LED tail lights as well, LED number plate lights. What you'll also find at the back here is rated recovery points. So if you're ever stuck or someone's stuck behind you, you can recover them with the back of your camper as well. While you're here as well, you'll find underneath there a 120 litre stainless steel water tank. You've got a full independent trailing arm suspension, tin coil spring, dual shock absorbers, you have parallel Timken bearings in there. You've also got 12 inch electric brakes. On the Jackson Ford folds, you'll find a winch front and rear of the camper. What they're for is um, help you open and close. So no heavy lifting, it's all done by the winch. Here at the back of the uh, Jackson Ford fold, you'll find another little compartment. Open your compression lock up. Again, you'll find full automotive pinch weld rubber seal, no dust, no water, and you don't want any in there because this is where your electric pump hides. So, electric pump for all your water, easily accessible behind the little shroud there. It's out of the dust, it's out of the water, it's going to last you a long time. Moving up here to the next door, folks, what you'll find behind this one is your full electrical system. And I mean this camper trailer's got the electrical system like you've never seen. What you'll find with these is full isolation switch there as well, so when you're not using your camper, you can shut it all off, it's not going to be draining your batteries. Water level indicator, so push the button and you'll see how much water you've got in your tank. You've got switches for everything there as well. You've got automatic reset circuit breakers in there. Um, 12 volt sockets, you're going to find seven of them right the way through the van and one of them's a USB one as well. Indicators there, that'll tell you how much power you've got in your batteries and that'll tell you how much power the actual um, camper's using. And speaking of batteries folks, you get not one, but you get two 100 amp hour AGM batteries with this camper trailer as well. Um, LED strip lights, you'll get three LED strip lights with it as well, so it lights it up beautifully. As I said, as far as electrical system goes in camper trailers, this has probably got one of the best I've ever seen. On the roof of the Jackson Ford Fold, you're going to find yourself a boat loader. Fully automatic, 
tilts out the side there, all gas strut assisted as well. And what you'll find on our gas struts too that you don't find very often is these little dust covers. What they do is they protect all the seals in your um, gas struts there. So when you're opening and closing all the time, the dust doesn't start scoring all your seals. And before you know it, you've got leaking everywhere, boat loader's not working. Boat loader's rated to take 120 kilo. Don't have to use it for a boat. You can store luggage up there, you can store firewood all your other bits and pieces as well. The other thing you'll find is nice stainless steel everywhere. Over centre catches, all stainless steel as well. So only the best will do. At the front of the camper here, you'll find storage, storage, storage. Again, nice over centre catches, pinch weld rubber seals. That shelf there goes right through to the other side there. Plenty of storage there for all your goodies as well. And speaking of goodies folks, have a look at this. So gastrite assisted door again. Plenty of storage room up there, and with the Jackson Ford folds, what you get, three one metre long LED strip lights, your fire extinguisher, your hitch receiver for your poly block hitch at the front, spare wheel tire, tire remover, all your keys, plus your straps. We went through the fridge box slide before, they're the straps we supply you so you can tie your fridge down. At the front of the camper here, you'll find two jerry can holders, 20 litre jerry can holders on there, two four kilo gas holders as well with your gas reg there, all the gas is permanently plumbed right the way through, gas certificate supplied. Stone guard at the front there, protect your trailer, nice big mud flaps either side there. Again as we said, winch front and winch rear, so you can winch this open and winch it closed, nice and easy, nothing hard all about it. Jockey wheel at the front there, handbrake as well, rated safety chains, rated shackle and a nice little hook there to keep them up out of the way so they're not dragging along the ground. ADR compliant poly block off road hitch there as well. 50 amp Anderson plug and your choice of trailer plugs. But flat, round or large round, take your pick. I love those things like so simple, set up, so done. simple. They are yep. beautiful and almost like a little pop top caravan. The features in it, everyone's yeah. up off the ground. You it's, don't have to uh, worry, obviously, about bad weather and things like that, too. No, no. If, you, if your camping if your camping experience turns really bad and this is turning to mud, you got somewhere in the lounge area that you can all sit in. Yep, pop the kids up there. Uh, those bars as well, if you want, you can actually move those bars to the back corner so they're out of the way. Mm -hmm. Just run a spreader through the roof there so it really does open up that back area. Perfect. One of the great features I love about this thing here is the extra bed area. Mm. So you've got a table underneath here that converts down to a full big like, double bed area here. You can use it as a day bed for yourself to sleep because it's so nice and breezy in here with the windows open. Um, you can have a little day nap. Correct, correct. <laughs> or um, simply lift your cushions up out of the way. So it's just these two middle cushions there? Yep. Remove your infill, that's one of the infills. And your last piece here converts into your table. So pretty much legs out. You can adjust these legs up to whatever you want. And you've got yourself an instant little table there. So these cushions here, or what I do with these ones here, live up the back there. So it makes you something to, um, to rest up against. So you can sit there, read your book. Yeah, sit there, read your book, have a glass of wine, have a beer and just Relax and comfort in your camper trailer. It makes it nice and airy, nice and open. Mm -hmm. It's um, it's it's a comfortable, comfortable camper trailer to be in. Mm, yeah. Definitely. So, um, yeah, one thing I love about this is just so comfortable. It's a comfortable area in here, nice and breezy. You have mm. your midgy screen mesh there, so um, you're not going to hear the nasties inside there. Yeah. And um, up against your arm there. Oh, I'm pretty comfy in the corner over yeah, here. Yeah. <laughs> Internal window flaps as well as external ones, so if you've got the tent open, it's getting a bit cool during the night or starts raining, you can zip mm -hmm. everything up from inside, so no need to go outside. Yeah, definitely. Um, another one, gusseted tent bows. In the corners, you've got the triangular gussets and all the tent bows up there. Added strength, because they do they are a nice tall camper to give you plenty of breeze, those gussets just add extra strength to your bow structure. Now we've actually got a tropical roof as such over the top of this we as do, well. We do, yep. that's why it's so much cooler in here. It's, yeah, um, definitely. It's an extra layer over there, gets you, gives you a pocket of air, so you can get air circulation on there, but it keeps the direct sun off your roof. Yeah, and with your adjusters on either end, obviously yep. three on each end and two, uh, one on 
each one in the middle there, uh, yep. nice and tight, keeps it taut, doesn't yep. flap against the top of the tent obviously. Yep, stays on there, don't have to touch it, pops up with the tent, mm. does its thing. Yeah, definitely, yeah. definitely. Get it folks, here we are, your Jackson's all set up. Nice and easy, nothing hard about it, everything's been straight forward. It literally took us like around the 40 minute mark. Nothing hard about it, was it Leash? No, we've done everything. We've, we've literally put the floor in, we've put the windows in, we've done everything. Yep. So yep. this is your complete setup within that 40 minutes. Yep. Yep. So It's ready for you and your family to go out and enjoy the weekend, so get into it.